Today's video is going to be about editing slideshow templates inside of DaVinci Resolve. I have created a few slideshow templates for DaVinci Resolve and uh, I've been getting a lot of um, comments and emails that uh, the template is not working. Now the main reason for that is the font that was used to make this project is not installed on your computer. So I have a project here open. Uh, this is uh, this is my short opener DaVinci Resolve template. Um, as you can see, if I scrub through the timeline, you can see that nothing is really um, put there except this grid over here. Um, there is no image, there is no text. In my image placeholder over here if i open up my image placeholder one let's open it in a timeline and drag and drop in an image let's replace it over here and now if i go back uh, to my main timeline over here you can see nothing is really happening over here nothing has been updated now the reason for this is your text placeholder so if you go here and you have all these text placeholders over here now if i click on text one right click open it in timeline uh, you're going to notice that we have this text over here text plus and it has this text over here that says slideshow one but we are not able to view it on the screen over here and the reason for this is because the font over here it says be best new and i don't have this font installed on my system so you need to make sure that whatever font is mentioned over here you have that installed on your system and to install it, you have to open up your web browser and search for that font on Google. I searched for BBAS new font and it's the very first link. It's a font by Google. You can just download the entire font family and, you know, install it and reopen Resolve. And then you'll be able to see the text over here. If you don't want to download a new font, what you can do is you can go ahead and just change the font over here just change it to something different that is already installed on your system so there's a font called Arial which is already installed on your system so you can go ahead and use that and increase the size and all that stuff and now if you go back to your main timeline you will see that everything will be updated right over here and similarly you do this for the second slide over here as well so now if I go to my image placeholder on uh, image placeholder to open it in timeline, even though if I change the image, you know, replace it, then in the main timeline, you won't be able to see anything. And the reason for that is because the text is not updated. Yet. So then to make it work, you just have to go to text placeholder, open up text placeholder two, and just switch it to a different font. And that is already installed on your system. And you know, make changes if you want. And in the timeline, you will see it updated over here. Um, so that is pretty much it. That's how it works in Resolve. Make sure the text is updated, and then you will see everything else being updated in the main timeline over here. Thank you so much for watching the video. See you guys in the next one.